and this is the inner beauty so today i thought i'd take you through all my lipsticks or my mac lipsticks um and you know show you the colors i have which i think suit my skin tone i am a nc50 or match master 7.5 i believe and um i hope this is helpful to all of you chocolate girls who have my yellow undertone and your you know dilly daddling about buying a lipstick and don't know if the color will suit you or not so let's get started bye so let's get started with the neutrals so this first one is called touch it is a luster i believe um this was one of my i think this was my second lipstick i bought from mac um it is so nice this color it is a neutral brown it's something you can just throw on and go you don't need to line your lips or anything at all and the lusters as always are very moisturizing so i really really love that one in fact i think i'm on the end bit of that one the next one is taupe this is a matte now this you definitely have to use a liner i'd suggest chestnut um, which is the one I think I'm showing you now um, yeah that negates all sorts of wrongs when it comes to lipsticks on women of color and um, this has got a peachy undertone um, and I think because I'm an NC50 it's a little bit too cool for me almost so yeah but I love that one next one here is fresh brew and this is also a very nice cool neutral undertone lippy it is a luster it definitely needs um a lip liner chestnut again is the lip liner of choice um i think it doesn't look too bad here but i think it looks even better when i've lined my lips so the next lippy i think this one was capricious um it is a luster and you know sometimes when you forget forgotten how much you love a lipstick well i think i just discovered capricious all over again yeah it's it's lovely it's got a pinky undertone gorgeous 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 lippy um yeah i really was digging capricious at this point um so the next one is spice it up this is also yeah i like to say spice it up um this is also a luster it's more brown in its undertone um but you know as i say with lusters if you want to wear something glossy um then the lusters are the best ones to go for love 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 this one again um i think i'd forgotten how nice um spicy up was so this is my next lippy and this was flat out fabulous definitely definitely needs a liner i use current um it is retro matte it this thing is as dry as anybody's business um so definitely definitely put some um lip balm or something on your lips before you apply this bad girl but once it's on and it's lined i think it can look quite fabulous as the name suggests love this one especially in the summertime or even the springtime um but as you know i'm not fussed about what time of year so the next one is rebel i love this one this is a satin and it's got a more rosy purpley undertone if that's a way to describe it but i love this lipstick it's very creamy it's very nice on the lips very moisturizing um which by this point i really needed this is my newest edition uh what is it called even oh gosh i've forgotten the name of this lipstick evening rendezvous that's it so it's a purple lippy but it's a neutral lipstick so that you can throw on without a lip liner now the next one is heroin which is matte um people say evening rendezvous and heroin are alike i'm not so sure i think heroin is more of a vibrant purple like a 
uh, what, what's it like a shocking purple you know and I think I definitely need to use um, heroin with a lip liner just to feel more comfortable so the next lippy is the Miley Cyrus Viva Glam lipstick which is fairly new out as well it is so orange definitely need to line this definitely I mean I look like oh god no I don't like that look at all so I'm gonna put um pair it with chestnut now just to show you how good a brown a good brown lip liner is at transforming any lipstick and I mean any lipstick into a brown girl's you know color shade so I've put that on now um blending 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 and there you go it's muted that down fantastically so the next lippy that I'm going to show you is ruby woo now if you're looking for a red lippy as a woman of color any woman at all any skin tone can rock ruby woo confidently um it is a retro matte however so I sometimes battle with ruby woo um to keep it from making my lips dry out like I don't know sand and this was my sort of not a replacement but just alternative to ruby woo which was mac red it is a satin and we know it's like a semi matte the satins so it's a lot creamier um yeah and it's got the same blue undertone as ruby woo or riri woo so when i can't be asked to battle with um ruby woo i wear mac red so my next lippy is the viva glam 3 lippy and by this stage you can see my lips are almost cracking to bits um this is one of my first i can't remember if this was the third lippy i bought but i really love this and i wore the heck out of it for some time as well when i first got it and yeah it's i've forgotten about this one i quite like it viva glam 3 yes quite like this one this one was a matte but more creamy matte the next one here i'm showing you is diva so we're going into our deeper plumier reds great for the fall winter season this is a deep burgundy i love 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 this shade this is my go-to shade in the winter throw that on you don't even need to line your lips next one's called sin i don't fancy the name much but i love the color it's a deeper version of diva and so if I feel like I want to vamp it up a bit, um, yeah, I'll reach for this one. Um, yeah, it's gorgeous. It is also a matte, but a lot creamier than the retro mattes. By this stage, I'm so tired. So this is Smoked Purple. It is my last lippy. It is a very deep, deep purple. This is the deepest lippy I have ever ever worn um at first i wasn't so sure about this but obviously you don't really need to line your lips with this um it is a retro matte i believe but it's a gorgeous color all the same so that's the end everyone i'm so knackered my lips are dry speak to you again soon.